Hey guys, it's Stephanie and welcome back to my channel. Today I decided to just sit down and do kind of a random um, haul video. Um, I have a box here from Thrive Market. Now if you haven't heard of Thrive Market, it's an online um, grocery store of sorts um, that specializes in like the organic and um, different special products and they're at a good price. So when you um, go on there, you do pay for a membership for, um, I think it's for the whole year and then you get discounts obviously on all the stuff. Um, so they show you like your savings that you have throughout the year and every time you place an order. It's not a subscription where you have to place an order like every so often, nothing like that. You just kind of do it as you please. Um, but anyway, it's really cool because on the website you can search like keto, paleo, vegan, um, any sort of thing like that. Um, they also started selling different meat. That part was kind of expensive for the amount of food you get. Um, so I didn't do that part, but anyway, I did find some keto friendly, um, products, um, lower carb, lower, lower sugar type products because that's kind of how I've been eating. So I thought I would show you what I got. This box is really heavy. To be honest, I don't remember everything. So when you get it, it comes like nicely packaged. Everything's recyclable, which I like. Um, all right, so we're starting off right off the bat. Chocolate. So this is Lily's chocolate. Um, I like this one because it's, you know, the cocoa and stevia sweetened, so it's not as high as sugars. There is erythritol, so it's four grams of that. Um, but carb-wise, it's pretty low, so that's why I like Lily's chocolate. I bake with Lily's chocolate, um, but I thought this would be good, just a good little snack. Just break off a piece and if you're having a little bit of a sweet tooth. All right, so they come in with all these little things when it's glass, which is nice so you know it's not gonna come broken. All right, so this first one is a Greek dressing and marinade. Um, I thought I could use this for chicken, um, things like that. Um, it is a little bit high in fat, 14 grams. It's made with coconut oil, red wine vinegar, apple cider vinegar, water, sea salt, oregano, black pepper, a bunch of um, a bunch of spices and that's pretty much it. No carbs. Um, so yeah, it's made with MCT oils and that's why it's higher in fat. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, I will keep that in the pantry. And then this one we've definitely used before. This is the Primal Kitchen Classic Barbecue Sauce. It is unsweetened. So how I use this is, um, I actually add my own like little bit of maple syrup, which obviously not low carb but it is a natural sweetener and I can control how much I put in there and I don't put in very much but this has very good ingredients it's just water tomatoes balsamic vinegar apple cider vinegar a bunch of spices um, not much per serving for calorie wise about 15 calories um, no added sugars there are three two grams of sugars simply because of the tomatoes um, so yeah I love Primal Kitchen. I get a lot, a lot of stuff from them. And I like that you on Thrive you can get all of this stuff because I live in the middle of nowhere and I don't have like a Whole Foods or anything I can go run to quickly. I have Walmart and Hy-Vee, which is another type of grocery store if you're not from around here. Um, but they don't have the best options always, so that's why I love this. All right, so this is raw cashew butter. Now, cashews are not low in carb by any means, um, but I saw a recipe for some cookie dough balls that taste like cookie dough, but are all like natural good ingredients, so I thought I would give it a try. I love cashew butter. It's just not low carb at all, and you know, there's 10 grams of carbs, two grams of sugars, but all that's in here is organic cashews. That's what you wanna look for. You don't wanna look for the stuff with the oils mixed in. So this is the Thrive Market version of organic apple cider. It was a really good price, if I remember it, for 32 ounces. It does have the mother with it, which you wanna look for the mother. That's where all the good like probiotics and things um, for your gut are in it. Um, yeah, you can just take a shot of this. 
Um, I thought I would throw it in with my juices that I've been starting to make, my green juices. So that's a good thing to have on hand. So I guess we got one more glass breakable item. So some nights you just, you don't have time to make a homemade sauce from scratch. Um, if you're craving something. So I thought we would give this a try with our chicken some night. So this is Thai co coconut curry, um, yellow Thai coconut curry. Pour and go, mix with your favorite veggies and protein. So all that's in here is coconut milk, red bell pepper, shallots, lime juice, garlic, and it is sunflower oil, but it's high oleic, so at least it's better for you. Um, but yeah, fairly decent in carbs for a whole half cup, which per serving probably won't use a half of a cup of this. But I thought this would be good to try just for a little different, a little something different one night. Um, I got these for my husband mostly. They are grain-free tortilla chips. I love the Siete brand. They are not much in here. I feel like this bag's smaller than normal. Um, but I love this brand simply because they use cassava flour, avocado oil, coconut flour, ground chia seeds, and salt. So how much better can you get avocado oil? That's a great oil to use. And then I also got the lime flavor, which they use real lime oil. So I like that. They don't use any natural flavors or anything like that. Okay, so this is something I've been really wanting to try. They're low-carb, paleo, and vegan. They're called Flackers. Um, there are organic flaxseed crackers made with sea salt. So all that's in here is flax seeds, organic apple cider vinegar, and sea salt. So not even any oils, which I just love that. Um, not many carbs, one gram of carbs. Let's taste one. I've been really dying to try these. Actually, I think they're pretty good. A little cheese. The cap. These would be really good with like cream cheese on them or just with cheese and crackers. I like those. Of course, Ryan says I have no taste buds left. That's my husband, so who knows. Um, and then I got the rosemary one as well, which I think these are good. It's a good snack. Calorie-wise, it's 10 crackers per serving. It's 160 calories. That's really not that bad. I don't think you're going to eat 10 of those. So this is kettle and fire um, bone broth. And it's chicken bone broth. It's made with organic free-range chickens, which is what you want. And really just a bunch of spices, um, no oils or anything like that. One gram of carbs, 10 grams of protein. You can just drink this to if you're like feeling... Like you need to not be sick. Um, it's a good thing to just kind of have a little cup of, but I use it in my cooking a lot. Um, when I put things in the crock pot, like if I'm just um, shredding some chicken for some other meal, I will cook my chicken in this, um, in the crock pot, so then it's um, not dry, which who likes dry? All right, and then I got these. Now these are not the healthiest thing, but sometimes you just need a treat. Um, but this is uh, the Good Fats um, Keto Bars. They're basically kind of like protein bars. Um, you know, they're not made with the best oil, I don't think. I think, yeah, palm oil. Not the best oil, but not that many carbs. About 5 grams of net carbs per serving. There is 1 gram of added sugar. Um, I don't know, I thought this would be just a good treat when I'm really craving like a candy bar because it's definitely better than a candy bar. Um, and then because I bought all this stuff, I did get free. Um, these are also the Good Fats protein bars with their different flavors, which is really cool. All right, so that's everything that's in my Thrive Market haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more videos like this, go ahead and give this a thumbs up. Keep on subscribing, and also make sure you're following me on Instagram. My, um, it's at Stephanie V. Runyon. Um, definitely follow me on there. I post when I'm eating for dinner. I post daily motivation videos or little clips to help you get motivated to work out, things like that. So make sure you're following me on there as well. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. 
say my name until the city burns and the stars fade away and your scars don't hurt stay with me until the last man falls i don't need them anyway when i'm with you i have it all oh i'll never let you slip away oh and you don't have to be afraid i will hold you till the sun comes